we're here today to take a stand for justice. We're here to fight back against austerity and cuts, and we're here to take back our compensation system. And we're not just going to stay here at Queen's Park today. We're going to march down university. We're going to make ourselves loud. We're going to make ourselves seen. I've lost my leg 55 years ago when I was 17. But now I'm losing a bit my balance because I'm getting older. So my doctor said there are good knees that would stabilize you. What did the board reply after 55 years? I'm too old. I'm not worth it. Okay, they say that probably in five or six years, I'll be a dead man. Our pain kept us awake. Our worries kept us awake. Losing our assets kept us awake. Worrying about our family kept us awake. Falling down into poverty kept us awake. Fear and depression and many more reasons kept us sleepless. We are being penalized for being injured at work. We did nothing wrong. We are the victims of unsafe workplaces. But we get victimized again and again by the very system that was set up to help us. This is our compensation system. It is workers' compensation, not employers' compensation. From underreporting, interference, ignoring advice of medical professionals, and systemic discrimination. We see systemic discrimination of injured workers based on age, based on need, based on injury. Everyone deserves to go to work and make it home safely, and those who don't deserve to be treated and compensated with dignity and fairness. This is not a day about politics. This is a day about making Ontario as safe as possible. People are going to be treated with respect and dignity, whether they belong to unions or not. It's called the Federation of Labour. And my job as the President is to make sure that every worker in this province is treated with respect and dignity. Every young person in this province respect and dignity. Every senior, every retiree, respect and dignity. Because you know what? That's the Ontario we want and deserve, brothers and sisters. Keep up the fight. Thank you very much.